All right, hello guys, and thank you for tuning in. My name is Marjan, and right now what we're gonna be uh, doing for this tutorial is for us to connect or split screen our monitor for our desktop or our laptop. And I got here is my laptop, which is an Acer Aspire 5, and I'm gonna be connecting it to a uh, monitor here. Uh, a, a monitor and we're going to be using a, a VGA uh, adapter uh, monitor for this so some of us may actually be uh, um, knowledgeable already about this uh, idea and uh, maybe you're actually using it right now so this video is not for you but there are still some people out there that are still in the dark trying to find the answer on how to split screen their monitor so if you're one of those person then this video is for you so don't uh, forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for more videos so without further ado this is what you actually need first you actually need this one right here this is what we call a USB to VGA uh, adapter you can actually buy it or buy this from a nearest uh, computer store so that's again a USB and VGA, USB to VGA or VGA to USB monitor uh, adapter. And this baby right here actually does include a an installer right here. So if you actually got this, you may actually be receiving this one right here, small uh, micro CD for you to install the driver for this one. Okay. So what you're going to be uh, doing, of course, you're going to be connecting your VGA monitor to this VGA adapter right here. So male, male adapter right here to your female VGA adapter. So we're going to connect it right now. It's not rocket science, so it's going to be easy for us. There you have it. You can actually secure it here as well. This side and plug it into your machine right here so we're going to be connecting it to of course one of our usb ports there okay there you go all right so now it's actually connected but as you can see it's still not showing up the screen because we still need to install the the driver for this device okay so to install the driver on this device you just need to pick up the document or the file within that particular uh, disk that you received and then uh, you just need to run this so here is the file that i actually got from that disk i already extracted it to from one of my computer that has a, a cd drive and after that what we're going to do is we're just going to run it as admin and once you actually got it running there you go it's just gonna be a, an easy step for us to install it real quick here and there you have it it's installed once it's installed you can actually easily see it right away it's gonna uh, go through the other screen on your um, uh, dual sprit or dual monitor or another monitor that you actually connected with that uh, funky adapter that I mentioned so at this point we actually have dual screen right now showing on our uh, monitor as actually seen on the video there and what we're gonna do you can actually change the display settings there and identify which one you actually want to put as your primary monitor okay show extend this display there you go so you just need to go to the display setting option for your monitor and extend this display so what we're gonna do what we're having now is this one as our primary and this one is gonna be our uh, secondary screen there you go so if you're going to be playing something in the uh, screen here, you can actually just uh, 
uh, for example you have a PowerPoint presentation you want to access and you want to show it on the other screen that can be uh, done okay so this is where the presenter view is so it's gonna be the primary monitor is here so if I present the screen right now I'll be able to see this screen right here as my primary uh, screen where the video will uh, the presentation or actually the it's the other way around actually let me just do it again there's an option here in the PowerPoint where you can actually choose which one would be the monitor so the presenter view would be this one so if you play it this is gonna be where your present presentation will be and this is gonna be where your actual page will be seen at so as you can see it's very simple you just need to purchase a device right there which is a VGA USB device now some uh, laptop may actually include an HDMI port you can also use that but of course you're not going to be using this one that's going to be another video for us but you're going to be using an HDMI port or some video uh, or some of the uh, uh, LCD monitors right nowadays actually do have an HDI, HDMI connector that is where you want to connect it and you can actually just plug it in directly to your laptop but for this uh, uh, setup since we don't have in an HDMI port for this laptop and we don't also have an external or uh, an additional VGA adapter for this laptop you actually will be needing a VGA adapter uh, to USB and that should be the one that we'll be using for that kind of setup so I hope this uh, short video is uh, uh, able to help you out find the solution with your concern and again please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell for more videos if you have any comments or um, suggestions for the next videos you can let me know and and we'll uh, make it happen so again thank you very much for tuning in you have a good one goodbye